So I'm going to start by showing a couple of different ways to remove building gel. Building gel is a hard gel formulation, but it's also a soak off. So the first thing I'm going to show is how to file off building gel. So you want to start with your files and you want to take off the really sharp edges um, when you're filing either on yourself or on a client so that you don't cut them. So I'm just use another file and just take off the really sharp edges. And just go over it really lightly a couple times to take off all those sharp spots. Okay, okay so I'm going to start with the Ruby file, which is a 100 grit file. This is a pretty aggressive file. If there's a lot of extra length, you can file it down first. Um, and I'm going to take down a lot of the bulk off the top with the Ruby file, which is a 100 grit. It's fairly aggressive, so you don't want to use it too much because gel files fairly easily. down a little bit with this. And then I'm going to switch to a softer file. So probably the Sapphire, which is a 150. When I'm filing back around the cuticle area, I'm angling the file just a slight bit, being careful not to file down into the natural nail. Pull the skin down on the sides so that you can get in nice and close. Most hard gels have to be removed by filing. So any hard gel that you're wearing or your clients are wearing, this is the typical method for removal is filing. Once you file down a little bit, you can brush off the dust so you can see where you're at. Getting there. Okay. So continue to file. And now I'm filing carefully, watching where I'm filing. Okay, now you can switch down to the emerald file, which is a 180 grit. Continue filing. Still a little bit more there.
make sure that while you're filing, you're paying attention to where you're filing so that you don't over file into the natural nail plate. So a little bit left at the free edge. I'm just gonna come down, focusing on just filing at the free edge of the nail. And I'm not applying a lot of pressure. Then you can switch to buffer. Buff the nail nice and smooth. Using the 220 side of the buffer first. This is the diamond buffer. side, which is the printed side of the buffer. Again, brush off the dust. Apply some lavender cuticle oil. Rub it into moisturize. And there you have a hard gel or filing off of building gel.